Hello everyone, this is Abdul Hamid from Luna Studios and in today's tutorial I'm gonna teach you how to create these long shadows. So last night I saw a very good tutorial about these long uh, shadow on motionarray.com. You can check out there and uh, today I'm uh, sharing uh, how to create it and uh, after combining several uh, effects how to create your own preset so you don't have to uh, do all the things again and again uh, so you just can go and uh, use the preset uh, every time you want so so here we are with the plain text uh, so let's get to the effect to get the effect just on this form so drop it here duplicate it like this you need two of them and just go to effect and preset and try the mini max drop it here place it between the transform uh, effects then go and type fill effect like this let's just change the color something like that and go and type cc pause it so here that's all we need for now like this and uh, to make the a long shadow go to minimax and change the color channel to uh, alpha and color and change it to just vertical like this so uh, it's not placed right so to place it uh, in the right uh, position uh, we have to use an expression uh, for this so just go to transform to we can uh, uh, type some expression for the anchor point so just while holding alt click anchor point like this and bracket type whatever I am typing right now value bracket zero bracket comma value bracket one bracket minus and just pick this one up okay let's minus pick this one up and go connect it with the radius from the minimax and close the brackets as you can see uh, it's in place right now so you can change it it will stay in its place like this uh, but we need a uh, now rotation so if we rotate it uh, it doesn't look good so we have to uh, use another expression for that and just go uh, while holding alt click on rotation from the second one and parent it to the rotation from the first transform like this and uh, type multiply or star minus one so it will go in the opposite direction uh, if we change it to one it will uh, go in the opposite direction the transform to it will go into minus one so as you can see oh, sorry like this Got it. So just go to minimax and extend it. So here we are with the effect. So it's almost done. If you want the lines uh, for uh, your shadow, like I had in my example, so just go. So here we are with the effect. So in transition, Venetian uh, blind. I think that's how it is pronounced. So just drop in it onto the uh, Luna Studios your text and place it uh, beneath the minimax I think it is. so here we are with the line you can adjust it you can play with it whatever you want and it's cutting our text too so to get rid of that go to CC composite and uh, uncheck this RGB only so here we are so 
so if you want uh, don't want to create this uh, again and again this uh, 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 this combination of effects to get the long shadow you can just uh, go and click control plus a it will select all the effects uh, to create a preset you have to select all the effects and go to animation and click on save animation preset so here you can save your animation preset to wherever you want uh, I recommend saving it in the preset folder in of after effect uh, so you can just uh, type your uh, preset name in here and it will show up so name whatever you, you want to name the preset I have right here long shadow preset so just after uh, saving the preset you don't have to do all this work just go and type in your preset name and drop uh, the preset on text like this so it will create the long shadow if you like this tutorial uh, uh, and want more like this subscribe and hit that like button uh, if you want it and I know you want it and follow me on Twitter and thanks for watching.